Hey guys, Crypto Sam here. Today I just wanted to go through the whole process of buying Bitcoin on your Coinbase account and then sending that Bitcoin from your Coinbase wallet over to your Bittrex wallet. Now the first thing you want to do is head to the buy and sell tab on Coinbase. Now you're going to get sent to this page and it's pretty self-explanatory. What you've got to do now is type in the amount in pounds that you wish to buy, um, the amount in pounds that you wish to spend to purchase Bitcoin. Now I'm going to be buying £10 worth for this, this tutorial, just a little amount. So you put in the amount you want to spend, press the confirm buy button and that should go through. Now I skipped out that part because it's taking a little bit long to process but the uh, payment did go through. To double check that your Bitcoin was purchased, all you simply do is select the accounts button along the top. You then select your Bitcoin wallet and you should see the amount that you have in Bitcoin in that wallet. Now I purchased £10 worth, uh, they took 4p as a fee so I'm left with £9.96 worth of Bitcoin. Now from here I want to send this Bitcoin over to my Bittrex wallet. Now the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to find out what my wallet address is on my Bittrex account. To do that I have to head over to Bittrex. Now I'm on my Bittrex wallet's account, what I'm going to do is I'm going to head to the home page and I'm going to go to this, I'm going to show you how to get to that page. Now you go and select the wallets tab up here. Now the next thing you do is you scroll down and you find Bitcoin, which is here. You then press the plus button, to, which means you want to add Bitcoin into your, to your wallet. Now what this will show is it will show your Bitcoin wallet address and it will also show the QR code. Now we're going to be sending it via the address, so what we're going to do is we're going to highlight that and we're going to copy it. Then we're going to head back to our Coinbase account. Then we're going to head to the, the send and request tab. We then paste the wallet address we copied from Bittrex and then we enter the Bitcoin amount that we wish to send. Now they've got a handy button here which says use max which just well, self explanatory puts the max amount of Bitcoin that you have in your wallet in. Now once you're happy with that you can check the fee, you can check the total that you're sending and if you're happy all you do is you press send funds. You then confirm and your send has been complete. Now, to double check that your send was done, you again go to your accounts, you go to your Bitcoin wallet, and you should see the sent amount out. Now, the send is pending, so it's going to take a while to get into my Bitrix account. At the moment, Bitcoin's got an issue with their block size, which means that the amount of transactions that are actually signed by the miners. Um, are actually being overloaded at the moment. So you can have quite a long process in time for sending payments. I mean, a friend of mine was waiting 24 hours, had to wait upwards of 24 hours for Bitcoin to drop into her account. Uh, it's improving recently, but don't fret if your Bitcoin doesn't send instantly as it's actually, you know, pretty common. So that's been sent over and that's it. So once that's uh, been processed, that will show my Bittrex account and um, I'll be good to trade. So I hope that's um, I hope that's been helpful for you guys. If you have any questions, just uh, drop me a message, and I'll see you later. Take care.